Good afternoon, YouTube. It's your man, George Page, coming to you live, live on YouTube. Well, this has been a pretty busy um, first um, couple of days. This whole week's been a lot of um, um, birthdays for bodybuilders, as I posted already. Um, two videos, you know, wishing some happy birthday to um, a couple of ladies at Iron Sport. And this is a third for a lady who's, she's a champion, she's a legend, she's been in the business for uh, a little over 20 years. This is one Miss um, uh, Hella um uh, nielsen trevino now you know she you know if you know anything about her she is a two-time women's bodybuilding award champion you know she was uh at one point she was one of the youngest um women to compete at the miss olympia back in 2003 now she was born in um denmark on a farm and as a young girl she was studying you know to go up to you know studied english german and even her own language of Danish. Of, of Danish. Now, around when she was three years old, she was into sports. She, you know, um, did gymnastics, and she did other sports, such as you know, swimming, track and field, uh, martial arts, and even boxing. You know, and she even did a little ballet and yoga. Now, when she was seventeen, she uh, got joined a gym with to lift, you know, help her with her training. And then she really got into it. Now, by the time she was 22, she competed in her first bodybuilding show, which was a Danish um, championships. Now, after that, she uh, had a good credit, competed some more shows in Scandinavian championships. And then she made her professional bodybuilding debut in 2003 at the Jan Tanner Classic, where she won the heavyweight and overall um, title. Now... You know, and then she made her first, she did her first, um, as a game of Miss Olympia in 2003, where she placed fifth. But then, tragedy struck. And, you know, and this happens quite often, to, you know, to athletes. Injuries just set you back. She had a, a herniated disc, and she tore, and she teared a bicep. So, pretty much, she was out. So, while she was covering, she got to the other side of the business. She became a trainer. She, uh... You know, worked in the you know, nutrition and um, supplement business part of it, you know, and then she just, you know, took that time just to, to recover. But she made a return in 2011 at the um, FIBO, you know, Power Pro German show, where she took first place in the women's bodybuilding division. Yeah, and then she, in that same year, she competed at Miss Olympia and took 14th place. Now, she kept on competing for a good while, and she made another, her third Miss Olympia appearance in 2012, where she took 12th place. And she competed in more shows, notably. She was also in the um, inaugural um, Rising Phoenix show, where she took second. Now, she's been doing the Rising Phoenix for all the last five years. You know, she, uh, in 2016, she took second. No, 20, or 2015, she took second. 2016, she took fourth. She won the 2017 um, uh, Rising Phoenix and took fifth place the next year. Of them, she popped back in 2019 and won the um, tw the Tampa Bay Pro, and she won that same year the Rising Phoenix show. Now, I follow Miss uh, Trevino on social media, especially on Facebook. It was that a while ago? Her mother passed away, and I sent her condolences, and she answered me back, and you know. And I, I can understand now how it is hard to lose somebody special to her. To you. But she kept on competing even after the, the loss of her mother. Now, she lives in California around the Venice area. She still works and trains. Um, she, uh, she works with people who are disabled. She's been doing the last 15 years. And she even was one time a CEO and a founder of her own company, Team Evolution. Now... She is a uh, now. As I said again, her name is Helena Nelson Trevino. She was married. I don't know if they're still married or not. There's this, you know. I'm, I was trying to find so much about something about her husband, but you know, I hate to say it could be one of those marriages so he can stay in America. I hate you know that's something that happens quite often. But she's a great bodybuilder, amazing physique. I mean, you know, she's five five and she packs a lot of muscle on that frame. I mean, I I love the female bodybuilders from. Um, you know, around the uh, Scandinavian countries like 
you know, Denmark and Iceland and um, it's that Viking blood. I mean, <laughs> there's gonna be some great film body bits coming from that side of the world. And, you know, I know uh, this year uh, she's also on the uh, card for the 2020 um, Rise of Fear show, being that she's the current champion. And there's a good chance that she might also do the uh, Miss Olympia. Just for, you know, you know so like I said, it's just, you know, that's, as you know, Miss Olympia is coming back to the uh, o, o week, Olympia weekend. But like I said, I want to say, I wish her a very happy birthday. And I hope her, you know, she gets a, get to win a three-time, three-time Miss International, Miss, um, uh, for the Rise of Phoenix, uh, Miss, uh, the Rise of Phoenix show. If you've been enjoying the page, like, subscribe, don't like, don't subscribe, I'm out.